Hey everybody, welcome to the March favorites and dislikes. I think next month I'm going to take you to disfavorites, even though I think that's not a word, but hey, I'm going to make it a word. It's disfavorites, okay? Um, there should be a lot of stuff that y'all would like to see and some stuff that might surprise you. Alright, so the first thing is the green light. I did mention it in this light bulb in the last favorites video, but I love this color. And then we got... A shamrock shake. Unfortunately, this year I was not able to get a shamrock shake, so I made my own. And I think this is another shamrock shake. I also made a shamrock McFlurry, it says. Then there's a cute picture of me outside. And here's some shrimp. I think that was steak and broccoli. And then I love using the little baskets at Walmart. Then here's me trying the McDonald's crispy chicken sandwich. So good. And then I got the jelly baby, jelly baby, jelly belly favorites. May I say they all taste lovely. I think it's time for me to do the bean boozle challenge again. Because I ain't did it since my second year on YouTube. But yeah, here are the jelly bellies. And then I have this desk mount thing. I've used it for my iPad and my phone. It works amazing. Then I have the fruit bites, one a day. There's 49 cents. Healthy for you. Um, the Kit Kat Mocha and Chocolate has become my my new favorite candy when I get it. My cousin had ordered pizza. It was like barbecue and all that tasted good. Um, the Monsters, Inc. movie. Love it. You know, I love VHS. Uh, Coca-Cola, vanilla, coffee, still for wine. Ta my homemade tacos are the best tacos, period. Then we have the seaweed salad. I love getting this at least once a month and once every other month. Then we have the Perrier water. I've been trying to drink this more, but I also need to drink regular water. And of course, we have a dragon fruit. This is the most beautiful dragon fruit I've seen in a long time because they've been looking terrible. And then there's my favorite Bible quote, Philippians 4.13. And then there are these M&Ms. They have a very cha-ching taste, but taste good. Wingstop fries are like my second favorite. It would be McDonald's and then Wingstop. Then there's this chicken. The one was hot and one was regular barbecue then there's this book the sister of traveling pants actually i got back into reading so that's plus poppable sea salt and vinegar mm, this tastes so good put some cinnamon sugar it tastes extra good uh flavor shots flaming hot asteroids delish the amy's food i fell in love with this stuff i want some more um outside i can't remember if that's a telephone tower or what but it's just the nature for me and then there's me playing sims my favorite game ever period and then i got the bonus jack combo this this month bean should be up probably next week i can't put it up and then there's the parmesan bites with the barbecue chicken tastes so good the garlic sauce makes the parmesan bites a little extra but i still love them and then there's the dawn that dawn smells delicious i would want that in a body wash pronto and my last favorite on the list would be this chili cheeseburger from Wiener Stitchel. I love getting this um, burger. The chili, delish, but it's more delicious when it's fresh. Because I think I had this in the dislikes because, I don't know, lately some sandwiches, the bread don't taste fresh. Like, I cannot stand that. That's gross. And then let's head on over to the dislikes. Okay, so the first thing I have is this toothpaste. It was in the clearance section of Walmart. It's called Quip. Um, there is a lot of toothpaste in there, but I would just say get a plain flavor. I mean, I like the toothpaste. I just don't like the flavors. It's like Walmart watermelon. Not everything should be watermelon. I am just saying. The favorite is the coffee. The dislike is the bread. It just didn't taste as fresh. And then we have this coleslaw from this place out here. It tasted nasty. Y'all don't know how to make coleslaw. And the last thing I have is the flour, buffalo style chicken grilled cheese. It's good in theory, but I just don't, I don't love it. You know, I tried it one time, thought it was good. It was too spicy, but it just don't taste good. But anyways, this is it for the favorites. I will see y'all in April for some more favorites and disfavorites.